Moving closer to home, the Major League Baseball draft has now come and gone, and players with local ties are getting ready for the step onto the pro level. That includes JSU's Justin Hoyt. We caught up with Hoyt this afternoon, one day after being drafted by the Los Angeles Dodgers in the 22nd round. The redshirt junior's path to the professional ranks has been paved by hard work. After graduating at Oak Mountain High School, Hoyt was a preferred walk-on at JSU. He quickly earned a scholarship and a spot as a relief pitcher. He wrapped up his career with 20 saves, one of the tops in OVC history. Hoyt spoke with us about yesterday's big moment. I actually didn't even hear my name called. I ended up, uh, it got around the 20th, 21st round, and I haven't heard from anybody, so I started to, I wanted to walk outside and kind of clear my head to catch a breath. But um, I was sitting outside, had a lot of family at my house, and all of a sudden I just hear my house erupt, and uh, I got real excited, and I walked up the stairs to my living room, and everybody was just waiting there, waiting to hug me, and it was just an awesome day. Hoyt becomes the 62nd JSU player to be drafted since 1971 and the 17th under head coach Jim Case. He says he'll proudly represent the school that gave him his chance to elevate his game to the next level. I love Jacksonville State. My heart's here. Um, I, I love everybody that gave me the opportunity here and helped me to where I am now. And uh, I'm just I'm real grateful to carry on the Jacksonville State tradition at the next level. And it's funny, actually, at my, at my house, uh, Griff Gordon was the last one to be drafted. He actually came and saw me. It was almost like, we're like, he's passing the crown to this guy. And so uh, I think it's great for our program. It's great for the, the Jacksonville State baseball team. And I think that's a good way to let people know it's a great place to come play baseball. And I'm looking forward to see how they progress and how I progress on my own at the next level and come back to see those guys. Now things will move fast for Hoy over the next few weeks. He'll fly out to Arizona this weekend and sign his contract. Then he's expected to begin training in Utah with the Ogden Raptors in rookie ball.